Hey guys, it's KJ48, and welcome back to my Ark Survival Evolved Let's Play. This is episode 3, and I have just leveled up to 15. And look at this, a green supply drop just uh, came down. A level 15 one, so I'm pretty excited about this. My first supply drop of the season. Uh, I saw one white supply drop earlier, but it seemed a little too far away for me to bother. So we're going to just come on in here and see what we got. Alright, well, that's pretty nice. A bunch of stuff I need. Uh, too bad I... Oh, Jesus, hold on. Piranhas. I should have been aware of that. You know what? Just because you pissed me off. And I wouldn't mind if this uh, spear broke as well. It's just taking up a lot of weight. Oh, Jesus. Man, they, they did a number on me. They hurt my leg. I wonder if I'm going to die. Sometimes uh, when that little broken leg thing comes up, what does that mean? Can't jump, run, recover stamina, slower movement, and torpidity increased faster. Okay, so I should not bleed out by that. Man, I didn't know they were going to hit me that hard. That's rough. Alright, so I basically harvested berries. I made a bunch of, uh, I made a bunch of things for my, for my house uh, in between videos. And I am now ready to start uh, putting down some. And that that is a uh, that harpy is uh, it's a little distracting. Um, I guess it's supposed to be. It's supposed to get your uh, get your attention. Boy, does it ever! All right, so I've gone ahead and made a bunch of walls, um, and I just got a bunch more on that. Uh, it's too bad I learned the foundation because I could have used this blueprint for the foundation. But you know, what are you gonna do? Uh, it's not like you know you're going to get a foundation on episode 3, so, you know, foundation blueprint. So we're going to go ahead and take the wooden wall thingamabob. Where are we going to put the wall? Right in the middle? I'm going to put it on the side. Let's put it on the side. Nah, we got to put it in the middle, don't we? Let's put it in the middle. Which other ones did we get? We got a ceiling. That doesn't really matter. We did get a door. And let's go ahead and put the door down. Eight. There we go. We have a door, and now let's go ahead and put down the 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 nine wooden walls we have. All right. So wall here, wall here. Now, whenever you make a house, if you only leave the uh, the walls one high before you put a roof, it feels very claustrophobic. So that's why I'm putting this one too high. There will be no second story. This is kind of a baseline house. This is a a simple house. It's just gonna be my my getaway house if things go bad at my other house. Uh, in case you missed the first episode, um, I have a house right around this rock ledge right here. But the thing is, I saw a Carno running around over there. Um, so now I'm a little worried. So this is going to be like um, a safe house type thing. And uh, we are not animals. So let's... Do you pick up your crap automatically? Because I just walked over to it and now it's gone. Oh well. Maybe it disappeared. All right, so we'll just put the ceiling and this in here for now. And uh, good supply drop, good supply drop. Okay. All right, so what is next? Okay, so we did level up to 15. I put more points in health. I'll probably put points in health until I get up to 200 and then kind of like step back and see what's going on. We do have a lot of new things we can learn. All right, and uh, at least I thought we did. Yeah, we do. We can learn the raft. We can learn... Bug repellent. Patchy saddle. I'm not sure what that is. Raptor saddle. We are definitely going to want to learn. Although we probably could wait until we're actually going to use it. Let's learn the uh, large storage container first. Um, I do want to make stone things eventually. But we're not going to worry about that right now. I'm not sure what a water reservoir does. So we won't bother with that. Um, should we learn wooden ladders? Or wooden ramps? I'm kind of partial to ladders. Probably end up learning both eventually. Oh, here we go. Bow. Arrow. Now, what we want is the trank arrows, but I don't think we get those till 20. Yeah, we don't get the trank arrows till 20. That's kind of a bummer, um, because I really want the trank arrows. I probably won't even use any regular arrows. Um, wooden bench. I'm not sure what that is, actually. Is that just a sit-on? A simple wooden bench for group sitting. Okay, we don't care about that. Should we start making clothes? Ugh. 
I don't know. I don't know. Well, we're definitely going to need a Raptor Saddle. So let's, Well, no. We are not going to leave the Raptor Saddle because if we get another airdrop, the Raptor Saddle could be in there. So we will wait until the last minute to get a Raptor Saddle. We're not going to be able to get a Raptor until we get, uh, until we get Trank Arrows anyway. Um, should I make clothes? I don't know. I kind of want to, but man, they're, it's expensive. It's really expensive because I'd have to learn all these. You know. Uh, let's look through one more time. Blood, uh, no, 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 no. Compass, no. Uh, door frame, no. Wooden storage crate. Da, 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 da. Yep, that's it for now. We will save the rest of our Ingram points. Okay. So, um, what to do next? We've got a couple things we can do here. We can continue working on our house. We can go out and farm for more materials. Like, um, I mean, when I say farm, I mean go kill stuff. We could try and tame something. Uh, to you, I'm not really sure which I want to do. Uh, building up the house would give me more experience. I don't think I get a lot of experience uh, when I'm fighting stuff. But there's so many things. I want to start getting into metal. I think experience needs to be the key here. Uh, and because I need experience, I think I'm going to start building up the house. Um, because as I make the house items, that's going to be, yeah, I need to get up to where I can make a raptor, uh, I need to get up to where I can make a trike saddle, and I need to get up to where I can make, um, like metal tools. Yeah, I think leveling up is the most important thing right now. The best way I know to level up is to actually build the house, and I need a house anyway. So, I'm going to, I'm going to, uh, pause the video here, I'm going to go collect a bunch of resources, and when I come back, we'll be doing some more building. So, see you then. Okay, I'm back, and I've just been cutting down a bunch of trees. And making a bunch of stuff. I've got four ceilings, six walls, two of the big storage crates. And I just saw an airdrop. So let's go and get that. Try to see what's weighing me down. It doesn't look like too much as you're going to wait here. Now, it's not a green airdrop. But uh, my buddy Probert, when I was playing with him, uh, he, you know, he plays this game a lot. Uh, and he said that you should go after every airdrop, especially in single player. Because you never know when you're going to get something, you know. Oh, of course, the Spinosaurus is camping the airdrop. Naturally. But anyway, we're going to go for it anyway. You never know when you're going to get something you could use. Um, and when I say by you can use, I don't mean stuff like, you know, that you can use, but stuff like, you know, blueprints. It's another reason you don't ever learn anything you don't need right away. You just save those Ingram points because you get an airdrop. Next thing you know, you get the, uh, you know, you get what you need in the airdrop. You know, like, uh, like let's say if I didn't, if, oh, God. Seriously? Seriously, you guys? You're really going to do this to me. Anyway, um, like, say if I didn't use the, uh, if, say if I didn't learn the, uh, the plants for the, uh, it's making me nervous. Let's say if I didn't make the, if I didn't learn the plants for the, um, for the foundation, you know? I could have, uh, you know, got them in the airdrop and that would have been great. This freaking guy. Pissing me off. I'm going to kill him so dead. I swear to God, I can't wait. He's going to die. He's going to die bloody. Him and those little scumbag friends. And the airdrop broke apart. Awesome. I probably would have got to it if, uh, if Jackass wasn't in my way. Ah, <sighs> game. Why you hate me? That one's really far, so we're going to leave that one alone. We're just going to try and get back in one piece. Yeah, I, I never go for airdrops because I'm always like, well, I'm never going to get them anyway, you know. They, they always, like, disappear, you know, quicker than I can get to them. But, uh, you know, I figured I'd go for it. Why not? Why not? I'm going to kill them so good. Oh, I can't wait. Five, four turtles and five dillos. Oh, God! Oh, God! Music? No music? What? Um, what's their aggro radius? Are they blind? Hmm. That was, um... That was weird. I mean, I'm not complaining, but damn. Like, psh, huh. Sweet. Dodged a bullet there. Alright, so it looks like there's an airdrop, airdrop over there. If I don't, have, like, know where the airdrop is, like, I'm not going for it. And I don't know how far that is. This could be really far. So, and never you mind. I don't need to be dying out there and then having to go back and get my corpse and stuff. Especially not for a white airdrop. That's a level 1 airdrop. Well, level 5, I think, actually. 
Got some more turtles here. Should we grab another turtle? No, we don't have any stones. Let's go back and get some, let's go back and get some stones and grab another turtle. We'll get uh we'll try and get Michelangelo. All right, you. You don't have my stones. My stones are in the chest, aren't they? Seventy six should do it. All right, we've got plenty of plenty of food, plenty of water. Well, not plenty, but we got enough. So uh, yeah, let's try and grab that turtle. See what level he is. I don't usually like to grab them when they're too high because it takes too long to knock them down and like you know, and all that stuff. But we'll see. Now, should probably clear this out because he's gonna have a trouble. He's gonna have trouble getting through this. And I usually I like to drag him back home. I don't like to. Uh, I like to drag turtles at least somewhere near my home. You know, like I don't want to like deal with them out here because you never know when something's gonna come along and grab them. You know, eat you, and then eat them. And everything's wasted. Alright, come on. Okay, let's go ahead and drink some water. And let's see what level this sucker is. Did something just disappear there? Look kind of weird. What level are you? Uh, level 14. It's a bit high, but we're going to go for it. And we'll just keep hitting him along the way. He's in no danger of getting knocked out, man. This guy's going to take a while. I've got the berries to get him. I've got the narcotics. I'm saving your life, bro. Let me tell you something. Being my pet is much better than getting eaten by that, uh, that, um, whatever that thing's called. I, I the, uh, Spinosaurus. So, you should thank me, Michelangelo. Alright, let's put you down. Put you to sleep. Oops, put all my guys in neutral. Crap, I forgot to put my guys on neutral. You guys better be on neutral. They need more, like, they need an early game dinosaur that can help you knock out dinosaurs. Because as far as I know, the first dinosaur you can get that can knock out a dinosaur is a, um, is a scorpion. It's not exactly early game either. Nope. Should have saw that coming. Come on, come on, come on, come on, come on. And I leveled up, by the way. Level 17, I think. Really gotta get to level 20. I realized I was getting so close to that trike. I was gonna say, I don't want to hit the trike, but it doesn't matter. He's stuck. Still don't want to hit him, though. Get him all pissed off. Down you go. Alright, who's got my stuff? I probably have the narcotics, actually. Yeah. Yeah. Got, those guys have the narco berries. This guy has the berries. Alright. You're already on my side. You can eat the crappy berries. This guy should take a while. Well, relatively... Relatively speaking. Alright, we do not want him... To fall too far, so let's give him backup berries. Just in case he runs out of the, the Mijo berries. And while he's doing his thing, why don't we go ahead and just bite the bullet and learn standing fires. Alright, we're at 200. We're level 17. Let's, uh, let's learn the standing, the standing torches. Because they're going to be useful, and I like them. Is there anything else we want to learn here? Nah, no, no, not at all. Okay, so we're gonna come on in here and well first thing we got to do is grab this guy There is a trick you can use with gamma. I'm sure you all know it um, 
I'm gonna try and not use it though. I'd rather use torches, but you know, uh, first things first, the most important thing to me is making a watchable video. Uh, so I'll use it if I have to, but I'll, I'll try not to. All right, so we should probably pick up that chest. Mm. Should we pick up that chest? Yeah, we probably should. It's not hurting nobody, just leave it there. I want to leave enough room for another one of these big chests in the corner, though. So that's about right there. So that should leave enough room for a big chest if we want to. There we go. Alright, looking good, looking good. Let's put down another big chest. Actually, do we really need two big chests? I'd like to start sorting my inventory, and there's no reason not to make more big chests. Uh, I was going to put the other big chest in the other building, but you know what? Whatever, we'll just make more. You get experience for it, so who cares? Come on. Come in. There we go. Okay, we don't need the foundation. We do need the ceiling. Um... Yeah, let's go ahead and put some ceilings on so when it starts raining, we don't have to worry about being in the rain. I like the I actually like the rain in real life. Um, although today it was raining really hard and it was getting quite cold. Uh, right there, I guess. Okay, number eight. Number eight. Number eight. Number eight. I want to put these on facing the same way, so hopefully they go the same way, and they didn't. I'm not sure why these things don't go the same way, but eh, whatever. All right, so now we need some more walls. Well, we've got enough walls here, so let's go ahead and finish this like so. All right, you know what? I want to finish that last roof. Do I have any more? Do I have any more wood anywhere? That should be enough for the last roof. Uh, ceiling. There we go. Let's go check on our guy over here. How you doing, brah? How you doing? Ah, you're doing good. How's your berries doing? I really hate farming berries, as you could tell, but I might, I might have to do it. I'm waiting for the for the trike saddle, and you guys will probably tell me what level I get the trike saddle, but as of right now, I really don't know what level I get it. So, all right, all right. I guess it doesn't really matter which way we're facing because it's going to go its own way anyway. Alright, let's replace some of these walls. Uh, zero. Uh, zero. Zero. Uh, one more wall. We're in a full wooden house. Well, let's go ahead and make that wall then. I want to finish this. I want this house done today. I think I'll definitely I think I'll definitely work on this during stream today. I think people get a kick out of watching me stream it. There we go. Alright, so now let's make some standing torches. Well let's see what we need for the standing torches first. Um oh god. Not I can make eleven. Should we make eleven? Probably not. How about six? Alright, the other thing I want to learn is I actually want to learn the ramps. So let me go ahead and learn the painting canvas. Okay, I didn't see that before. Alright, wooden ramp. Okay, standing torches, where are you? Okay, so we're going to put some out here. Um, eight, you can go right there. Eight, you can go right there. And then we'll put our gamma back on two. See, this is what it would look like. Um, I usually like to like to have these run on thatch. So maybe like five thatch. Seven is good. Usually no more than five. And there we go. See, the gamma thing's really nice, and I know darkness sucks for a video, but I really like the darkness of these games and the fact that you need lights. Um, is pr I think is pretty cool. Um, 
So, yeah, I can't even see in here, though. Yeah, three will work. Okay, so eight. Where do we want to put you? Put it in the corners? I wish they'd give us some kind of wall torch. That'd be pretty cool. Like something you could stick on the walls. All right, guys, just grabbing a screenshot. All right, uh, I probably need a little bit more light out here. Uh, I'm going to go ahead and make the ramp, if I can, if I have enough wood. Oh, yeah, I got a lot of wood. Um, well, we can't make the ramp. We're missing thatch. Yeah, we're burning all the thatch. Is there any thatch in here? Let's see if we got any thatch. No. Might have to grab some more thatch. Uh, nobody's got any thatch. Okay, fair enough. Um, it's dark. It's dark out. Oh, God, look at that. Oh, I want to go for that so bad. The thing is, I don't want to, like, die and then have to go back and get my stuff. It's not worth it. Not for... Not for a white airdrop. If that was green, I would probably go for it, but not for a white airdrop. Oh, I wish you could sleep and pass the night. That'd be pretty cool. All right, well, you know what? We have run out of materials. We have built our house, and I'm pretty happy with the way this is going, so we're going to call this one a little bit early. Uh, that's going to be it for Episode 3. We'll see you next time for Episode 4. Till then, take it easy.